Time to look at some of the best videos we got. A noise complaint turns into a wild ride and something that's maybe on my bucket list for a police officer in Texas. It all started with a call about a house party and there was a mechanical bull. <laughs> you can see the officer decided to try it out. He managed to hang on for almost 30 seconds before falling off. The crowdy, the crowdy, party crowd, not <laughs> the, the crowdy got party. rowdy. Yeah, the party crowd gave him high fives and cheers. In the end, the officers just told him to keep it down. Nobody got in trouble. Joked on Facebook, though, that the bash wouldn't have been that memorable if he hadn't shown off his bull riding skills. They seemed to take it a little easy on him in the beginning. Yeah. Well, he's got a gun belt yeah, on. We're not going to just he's throw got, him he's, off. He's got the ammunition on him. We're going to put I, it on the low. I wonder what code that is. You know, when the officer's calling, they say, you know, like if they're going to take lunch, he's like, oh, I have a 1021. So right. I wonder what riding a bull is. Eight seconds. 10-8. 10, eight. ten eight. <laughs> I'm going to take a 10 eight right now. <laughs> well, this will be probably one of the more inspiring videos you may see if you haven't seen it already. A 14-year-old in Illinois who was born with no arms showing us that you can do anything if you really put your mind to it. This was Tim Bannon, and he was attempting a mm. box jump. He misses it a couple of attempts to reach the 20-inch platform, but he doesn't give up, and neither do his coaches. Oh. There he goes. You can hear them cheering him on, and then he lands the jump, and he enjoys a hug with his coach along with some happy tears. Tim is part of Nubability, an organization dedicated to instructing and motivating young amputee athletes. That's hard if you have your arms to balance. I can't even imagine what that would feel like without having that to you. That is an amazing accomplishment. You know, you say he's 14. I kind of want to see what he does when he's like 16 and 18. Yes. He's going to be taking over the world. He's so happy. Well, the United Kingdom has gone from heat wave to hailstorm, mm -hmm. weather, and a dog. This is our favorite story. <laughs> One into. dog loved every moment. Watch. This is a dog named Mouse <laughs> running around during the hailstorm in Liverpool, England. The weather just, you know, got him dancing. The owner says her dog thought it was fun trying to catch the hailstones. The heavy rain and hailstorm was a welcome relief in Liverpool after the area's recent hot weather. And that was fun because they were little hailstones. <laughs> yeah, they, they weren't like the softball <laughs> size ones. And you were talking about that Thursday evening. They had some record heat in uh -huh. the United Kingdom and Europe and everything. Oh, so, that's right. So uh, the storm's there and it's really much cooler there. Really record heat, hotter but, than anything we've seen. But you know what? It's time for pause for pets. How about a dog named Hailstone? Hmm? Maybe? Maybe. Golden? It is time for this morning's Pause for Pets. We have a very energetic dog for you from the Hanover Humane Society. This is Riggins. Riggins is five years old, a Bassett Beagle mix. Very smart, playful, and affectionate once he gets to know you. If you're interested in a very energetic dog, give Hanover Humane a call about Riggins. Their number's on your screen, and we have more adoptable pets on our website, WTBR.com.